Belt and Sanding Nations have gone undefeated all year, and now they will battle it out head-to-head -head for the eight-man championship. This will be the first title game for Belt since 1994. The moment to make history is here for the Huskies, and they are taking it all in. Kind of surreal. I mean, it's pretty cool to be able to do something that not a lot of people from Belt do, not a lot of people ever get to do, so it's, it's just a good, good feeling. Belt has had three shutouts in the playoffs leading up to this championship game, and there's a reason why the defense clicks so well. I don't know. I mean, we got a group of guys, I mean, seven seniors that have been playing football together since sixth grade, so we got a lot of synergy and a lot of, I mean, we're connected, so I think that helps us out a lot. That defense will need to come up big as the team hits the road for the first time this postseason, but tough road games don't seem to phase the Huskies. I mean, we played Flint Creek on the road. I mean, tough team, really another tough team. And, you know, going into their home and beating them 44 nothing was, I hope, a statement to these guys, knowing that we can go into someone else's home and, you know, put points on them and not let them score. So, I hope they know that we're going. The game will kick off at 1 p.m. at St. Ignatius. In belt, Dante Williams, MTN Sports.